Here we are at the Beaufort Highway Farmer's Market. First stop on our safari. Meeting people, everybody looking good. Alrighty then. We're here in City Tower now, which is the main area where Buddhists buy their idols here in the International Village. You'll see, depending on the what they're looking for, you've got all these kind of items, which is for money. You notice the type of syncretism where Ganesha, who is Hindu, is still here because this is a business and they want to get money for this stuff. You'll see offerings to Buddha. A lot of times it's food type of stuff. They may have some candies and things. I don't know why they always got to have cognac for Buddha. Yeah, a lot of times. Um, this is the bottom. It's another type of Buddha right there. Uh, that's Wu. That's for prosperity. Wu, Lu, and Shu. All of this is just another example of works religions. All these items are for ancestor veneration. They're all made of paper, and then you would burn these, and then you would give that to your ancestors. You can see here is like an iPhone, and watches and stuff like that, and jewelry. And as grandmother would get that, then she would help you be lucky. In these religions, it's all about getting good luck and be, getting away from bad luck. And so whether the, the mirror is convex or concave, you will either scare the bad spirits or you will attract the happy ones. You'll see lots and lots of different kinds of incense. The main difference between that and in Buddhism is that in Buddhism you burn different kinds of incense because that's going to give you a particular kind of luck. We're in the Shiv Mandir right now. Shiva is the main deity in this place. It's his wife Parvati and their old son Ganesha. You'll see this is the offering place and that's called the Shiva Lingam and that's where they would put that. It's always covered by a cobra. Cobra was supposed to take care of, of Shiva when he was hot. Afterwards, after the, the offering has been made, they'll wash this off with water and then you can tell they finish because they, they put the, the flowers on them. Normally you'll also have, sometimes, Incense has been burned as a prayer, and that's also very common, not only in Hinduism but other religions as well, of having a burning oil. So in Judaism, that's big as well. This is Ganesha, it's one of the main of the Hindu deities, and this would particularly be good for wealth, prosperity. All right, here we are at Al Medina, which is one of the largest markets with with uh, my Muslim friends. That's Al Medina. Look at all those sweethearts. Oh, that's so nice. There you go, man. This is the Muslim center of the Metroplex here in Al Medina. And they can't draw pictures of Muhammad or any of their patriarchs, but they are allowed to draw of the Kaaba. And in Mecca, the Kaaba is the holiest place in Islam. And all of these banners are in Arabic, and all those are the different names for God. All these are different prayer rugs here. Very common to see a compass on these so that they know the direction to point it at to go towards Mecca. All these are different Qurans. You'll see things like this, which is the Fortress of the Muslim, which has a transliteration here. So even though you may not be able to speak Arabic, you can be able to sound it out. They have the, the prayer transliteration as well as what it means in English. Is this right? It's me. No. It's me. As you must know, as, as the past two days, you've learned about Jesus. Like, you know, the Samaritans, Jesus, Jews didn't hang out. Um, then there was Lazarus I liked, right? Well, Nicodemus was also in that ranking. At that time, Jews and Romans did not like each other. Ian. Oh, good. We don't want to do it. That was close, but not close enough. That's close enough. Okay. Okay. Now. He's a very smart man. He was. I said small. No, that was Zacchaeus. That was Zacchaeus. 
Thank you. Thank you. From a sinking boat. Well, I can enlighten y'all. See Jesus, and he asked him, no one can do miracles unless they're from the Father or from God. So who did he have to be from in order to make mir do miracles? Thank you, baby. So here we are in El Rosario with the baby, magnificent baby and magnificent daughter. We always learn something different. And today, what you see today, Ashley? Chameleon spray to be camouflaged from your enemy. Oh, so they can't see you because you camouflage. So they, it's sort of like itching where you scratch. They try to see where is it that you're scratching and then itch there. Like this one wants more money. Money house blessing, which is a very common situation. A lot of times they'll have, you know, you want a girlfriend, and they'll, whoops, and then they'll have others for different saints for what it is that you're looking for. Top here, we'll see all the different, like Saint Jude is this one. He's very big because that's the saint of lost causes. This is Santa Muerta or Holy Death. And depending on how she's dressed is what she's good for. You can pretty clearly see what this one is looking for, right? Money. Of course, we talked about other religions having idols and stuff, like Ganesha, like the elephant head god or whatever like this. But when you come to El Rosario, which is in Plaza Fiesta, it's Spanish, then you're gonna see all of our flavor of idols, whether it's a Pope or Mother Mary down here. This is the life-size one. Virgin of Guadalupe, you can see. And of course, the San Judas, so like Saint Jude. He's the, he's the saint of lost causes and because of the immigration issues here in the States, that's why they, uh, that he's popular. You also see these little cards they, they'll put in their billfold or something and they'll, at the, at the other side, they'll always have a prayer that you could say. Of course, the Catholic tradition is a lot about reading prayers and re repeating prayers because it's another works religion.